we know what she can do in college. We saw we saw that already. We you know what she can do. In, uh -huh. She did in high school. That's right. Yeah. She brings it to the pros as a rookie. What do you think is she thinking right now, and what does she bring to the table for for the comeback in F2? Well, Kalina definitely. She tapped me while we were uh, at the table. Right. And well, I was. She didn't know I was observing her during the warm up. And you can see she's profiling right away. Mm. Uh, yeah, you can see she's profiling the opponent. But Kalina, and then also trying to get the tempo with her setter. And that, I think, will be the main difference here. Sabi ni Mylene, yung start ng training nila, 30 minutes, puro free spiking, free spiking, uh -huh. free spiking. Yeah, laki ng ginaling din ni Mylene. Kale adjusts in mid-air, still alive, pop again. Back set. Oh, what a smart hit. You see that last four hits? No, hindi lang puro lakas. You can see the tactical side, individually at least, can slow down the ball, go for the weak spots. That's what just happened. Look at this. No replay. Angling it well. Sayang, no? Sayang. Because he's one of the best hitters uh, in the game. No? Establish yourself for the best mm. hitter. But of course, there's always a reason for mm -hmm. it, you know? That but the coaches thing, know, yes. Yeah, yeah. But you know, as coaches, we know, like the likes of Arundala, the strongest tool there is the mind. You cannot take her away from the court because you see things that others cannot. You right, know? right. Back here for Cherry Tigo is what I meant. As Fajardo takes a look at Laxina, rolls the ball to the other side. Good dive by Karandal. Easy ball. ball from the other side. Pinitik. Fajardo. Lumusot. Good reaction there by KKD, oh, and it is Kalei now, now it's puts it away. Now it's kicking in. Throw attack, that's right, yeah. So Good you save. Got, you gotta always deploy the back row attack, because once it, it engages, 